Hey, this is Judge Waits bringing you my weekly Zer video. We're going to check out what he has. I know he's going to be over here on the right-hand side because last week he was on the left-hand side. So he normally goes uh, middle, left, and then right. So he should be over here on the right somewhere. I'm not exactly sure. But we're going to find him. Now, I'm thinking about doing something at the end of this video. A lot of times I get questions, you know, hey, what gun are you using? Uh, let's see. There's a guy right there. And, oh, hey, there he is right there. All right, so that was easy. But I usually get a question um, that comes up, hey, what gun are you using? So I thought it would be kind of cool to show you what guns I have, what legendary guns and what exotic guns. So I'm going to show you that. I don't have a lot, but I'll show you what I got. All right, so here's what he has. And uh, there is what I'm looking at because that is a Warlock helmet. And that is my favorite character to play right now. So probably going to pick that up. I don't like that it's plus 82 strength. I'm not really crazy on that, but revive teammates faster, increase melee attack speed. Um, here's a gun, Truth Rocket Launcher. Ah, I was kind of hoping it would be something other than a secondary or special gun, but I'll probably pick that up. I don't think I have a Void Damage um, Rocket Launcher. I think I just have Solar and Arc Damage. Yeah, so uh, maybe I'll pick that up. What the heck? Probably want to collect a lot of the exotic guns just for the heck of it, but there is the Ar what the heck is that? Armamentatarium? Armamentatarium, yeah. Okay. The uh, Syphliophage Symbiote, <laughs> Hunter class. Don't really care about Hunter classes, not going to use them. I do have a Titan, but uh, I'm going to go ahead and pick up the Warlock helmet just because I have Warlock characters. Like I said, they're my favorite, so I want to collect as many as possible. I don't think I'll use it. And then I'm going to pick up this exotic engram, see what we get. And I'm really thinking about this rocket launcher. Either that, or I'm going to pick up some other stuff and just melt it down for shards. Uh. Hey, oh man, what do you guys think? Rounds fired from this weapon seek their targets aggressively. That sounds kind of cool. Alright, let's pick it up. I need to avoid damage, like I said. And then I'm going to pick up some auto rifle telemetry. Those are consumables that help you upgrade your um, auto rifles faster. I've got a couple that I'm working on. So I'm thinking about trying these out. I've never used them. I'll let you know how they work out. If you've used them, let me know too. Uh, but I'm planning on doing a video on how to level up your guns faster, so I've got a really good method. Can't wait to show you guys that. But here is the Cryptarch. We'll get our engram decoded. Any guesses on what we're going to get? Or what I'm going to get? Um, Crest of Alpha Loopy. We'll check out that Ingram. All right, so here I'm going to showcase my guns. Oh, there's the ones I have in the vault that I don't use or I'm done working on. But here is that um, oh, Hunter class. Awesome. That's the one I bought last week. Hunter class. Uh, okay. I'll probably just melt that down because I'm not using Hunter class. I have two Warlocks and a Titan that I'm doing or going to be doing. So, but um, that's the one, like I said, that I bought last week. Void Fang Vestments. And I don't use it because I have that helmet that I fully upgraded. So that's the legendary armor that I have. And I basically picked it up, bought it, um, just because of the auto rifle buff or the extra ammo. But here's the helmet that I have. And here's the one that I just bought, Light Beyond Nemesis. Cool name. Like I said, don't like it that it's 82 strength. But <laughs> I just like it because it's a Warlock helmet. And um, revive teammates faster. What's that mean? Spawn more orbs. I don't know. We'll check that one out. But here's my shoes. And my other stuff, but let's get into the guns. I'm sure that's what you're interested. Atheon's Epilogue got that in the raid, and that is one of the ones I am leveling up. Uh, can't wait to get this thing fully leveled up. Bad Juju, don't really care for that one. Uh, the Last Word just got that recently, and I can't wait to get that hand cannon going on there. But you can read the descriptions of these things. There is the Vision of Confluence got that in a raid, and it does solar damage, and it also goes fully auto, so it fires really slow. There's my other auto rifle, Exotic Hard Light. That is a nice auto rifle. Pretty pretty fancy, pretty nice. Uh, the Devil You Know, another exotic or legendary hand cannon, I should say, and a legendary pulse rifle. I actually like this better than the Bad Juju, so I want to get the Red Death, though, just to have it. But there is my favorite, the Suros Regime or Regime. Um, I really love this weapon, and what is this plus two agility? Huh. Uh, improved range and accuracy. Okay, that's why I go with that. Might have to try that out. But as far as my secondaries, I only have one exotic, and that is the Icebreaker. I actually have two of these. Uh, but I do have some nice legendary ones. There is a void damage one. I've got another void damage sniper rifle I'll show you here in a minute. Um, and there's an arc damage legendary sniper rifle. Pretty nice. 
I'm kind of lacking in the fusion department, but um, here is a solar powered one uh, and a arc damage. That is my only legendary one. Uh, but there's a solar, and this is what I really want. I really want a void damage fusion rifle, and I cannot get one. All right, but here are my heavies, the Koeing solar-powered, and then I've got the Unfriendly Giant solar-powered rocket launcher. The first one was a machine gun, um, corrective measure machine gun, which is nice. That was what I was using in the raid, and it actually does some uh, additional damage to oracles. Unfriendly Giant uh, arc damage uh, rocket launcher. And then the new one that I got, this Void Damage Rocket Launcher. Let's check it out and see. All right, so it looks pretty cool. Um, grenades and horseshoes. <laughs> nice. Detonate early. Um, these are all pretty just standard ones. Uh, heavy payload. Uh, flared Magwell. Here's the interesting one. Rounds fired from this weapon seek their targets aggressively. All right, so I can't wait to see what that does. Oh, getting a message. Let's play. Who's that from? I have no idea, but those are the weapons that I have that I'm working on, and these are the ones that are in the vault. That one you get from the story mode. Um, there is a scout rifle legendary that I don't use since I have that solar-powered one from the raid. There's another icebreaker. Dr. Nope, that is a fast-firing auto rifle. Um, I don't normally use shotguns, so I just kind of keep these over in the vault. Maybe I'll start one of these days, but another solar-powered um, rocket launcher. I think I have the same one. Zombie Apocalypse, that is a nice, that is a nice light machine gun, does void damage, and another sniper rifle that does void damage that I've used in the past, but I like the ones that have a little bit more, so I'm trying to level those up. And then um, another shotgun and the Bad Seed Down Pulse Rifle. So those are the weapons that I have. Let me know what you guys think about them. Let me know what exotic weapons armor that you have that you really like. I'm going to put these over on my character. Oh, and I should point out, I went ahead and did it. I broke down and used a bunch of my shards to level up my guy to a 29, as you can see, because I've been doing the raid. I've done it four times, and I've yet to get any raid armor. I was saving my shards for when I did get that raid armor. That way I could just level up fast. But, like I said, it has been giving me nothing, and I'm really frustrated with that. Let me know if you've done the raid and if you've gotten any raid armor or anything cool in it, because um, I've gotten some weapons, but as far as armor, I've gotten not. And, unfortunately, you need that raid armor to get to level 30, and that's what I really want. But that's where I'm at. Let me know if you've done the raid, and if you've gotten any armor, let me know how many times, too. But this is where I'm going to end it. As always, guys, take care, and God bless.